KM4 MKL here. This is going to be a run through for the escalation, the treasonous mimicry in Miami on Hitman 2. This is the level 3 run through. It's, you can figure out level 1 or 2 easy enough after you see this. I'm going to load out in the uh, Kaboon Pit with that disguise, a micro explosive, a lock pick, and the um, Silver baller. I didn't need the silver baller, and I had the uh, distraction stowed away, but I didn't didn't need it either, as it turned out. In fact, I don't think I needed the lockpick, as a matter of fact, either. Anyway, our first order of business is going to be to get a Kronstadt mechanic outfit. We do have to be wearing this outfit when all the uh, targets die, so I'm going to turn the generator on, <coughs> grab a hammer. And when this guy comes around, we're going to knock him out. And he's out. Take his disguise, pick the hammer up again in case we need it, and we're going to hide his body. We're going to cause an explosion to kill the first two targets that are listed up there, so... It's going to cause a lot of snooping around. He'll probably be found if that happens, so I'm going to make sure he's hidden. I'm going to grab another wrench here. Can't have too many of them. But we, are, we'll, we will need at least one wrench. As you'll see here in a second. I'm going to come back in here and try not to get spotted. Because now we are illegally back in here. The first target is on the other side of that wall. We're going to leave him in there by turning the generator on. And when he comes in, I'm going to knock him out using this wrench. I'm not going to kill him quite yet. I'm going to have to bring somebody else in there first. So I'm going to knock him out. Make sure that generator is turned back on. Either let him turn it on back on before you hit him, or turn it on yourself. Otherwise, another guy will come in there and spot the body when he investigates. Our second target is this guy right here. We can just walk right through that door. He's the only one in this pit area. So, as long as we don't get seen by him, which is easy to avoid, all we got to do is knock him out and drag him back in here to the uh, Kaboon Pit area and put him right next to the other mechanic. So these are our first two targets. We're going to kill them by creating an explosion. We can use this explosive to trigger the explosion, but you have to make sure that the propane cylinder there has been opened up with a wrench. If you don't do that, it'll still cause an explosion, but it won't count as an accident, even though you're detonating the tank itself. If there's a leak, though, it would be considered to be an accident. And we do have to make sure both those are people die in accidents in order to satisfy the escalation, otherwise you'll fail the mission. So do make sure that's opened up. So before we detonate that, I'm going to go ahead and take out this third target. Uh, there's going to be a huge panic as soon as we blow the, uh, the two guys up. So I'm going to save them for last. So, there's three guys in there. I'm going to take one of these out of the equation by knocking him out. Don't do it until he's turned around, otherwise I'll spot you as you do it. And, furthermore, the target that we're trying to kill will come in there and investigate. If he's Only if you're spotted, though. I'm going to dump his body in here. Again, some chaos is going to ensue, and I don't want his body found, because I'm going for Silent Assassin in this run. Now all we've got to do is hit this button right here to drop the car on the guy. There's a enforcer over there who will see us. Back to if we get out of there quickly. Okay, the first target's down. I'm not going to detonate the bomb quite yet, because there's going to be a non-target that will likely get killed in addition to the two targets, if we're not careful. So I'm just going to backtrack this way. And this guy who's nearest to us, who is standing right next to the where the uh, target spawned, is going to be too close to that wall, and there's a good chance we're going to kill him with the explosion, unless we get him out of the way. So if we just do this, you can see him on the mini-map, you'll see that he's gotten out of the way, and as soon as he moves away from that wall, I'm going to detonate. Now all we gotta do is get out of Dodge. There's gonna be a panic, so make sure you don't get spotted. I'm almost there, did there, but I got lucky. 
blend into the crowd as much as you can. You just got to remember that even if there's not a panic uh, triggered like we have now, most of the security guards are going to be enforcers for the mechanic disguise. Some of them won't be, but it's a good practice to be in the crowd so you don't get spotted by anybody. And all we got to do is get out, and this will give us the Silent Assassin a rating for this escalation. In addition to a halfway decent score. If you have any uh, questions or comments, put them in the comments, and I'll be happy to answer any questions that you have. If I don't know the answer, I'll find out or make something up. In the meantime, this is KM4MKL. Happy hunting and happy hitting.